America's Next Top Model is the reality show we've been most obsessed with ever since its debut in 2003. And throughout the many years and many model hopefuls, we all anxiously awaited the incredibly fun makeover episode each season. Here are the most incredible transformations in top model history. Since I won America's Next Top Model, I've shot for pretty much everyone in America. Whitney Thompson was the first top model to prove that you don't have to be skinny to be a drop-dead gorgeous model. Before she went on to win season 10, though, she underwent a bombshell makeover. This new look fits my personality a lot better. Jay Manuel told Entertainment Weekly, We tried to broaden her appeal, and it worked. On Cycle 24, Gina Turner was asked to remove her wig, a hugely vulnerable thing to do since she has suffered from alopecia since she was just a young girl. Doing this is really scary, but I want to show people that it's okay to be bald and that bald is beautiful. Turner ended up coming in second place, but that powerful moment won't soon be forgotten. I feel like the whole world can see me now, like I can see myself now. While Brittany Klein may have had a rough upbringing, she never let it stop her from pursuing her dreams. I'm a small town girl from a trailer park and I love being here. But what really helped secure her Cycle 16 win was her stunningly posh makeover. Laurent, the owner of the salon, he's like, are you ready? You're going to go short, black, with bangs. Brittany certainly showed off her versatility as a model and it clearly worked in her favor. Naima Mora wasn't one of the loud, in-your-face type of contestants, which is exactly why Tyra wanted to get her out of her shell. Naima, we're gonna make you honey blonde, girl! Jay Manuel told EW, The girls are responsible for presenting themselves at judging, and she worked that mohawk. Naima won cycle four, and it's pretty easy to see why. I represent a black girl, I represent a Mexican girl, I'm part Irish, I'm, I'm everything. I'm America's Next Top Model! <laughs> Fatima Saeed was the second runner-up for Cycle 10, but thanks to her phenomenal makeover on the show, she now has quite the resume in the fashion world. I'm excited slash nervous slash I don't know. <laughs> Fatima went from shorter hair with a brassy tint to rocking a totally dark and stunning mane. I never had weave. This is my first time. Like I was freaking out because he was pulling my hair that like my eyes just started to tear up. Manuel explains to EW that it, quote, helps cheat her proportions and made her look a little taller. I really have what it takes to be cover girl because I really feel like a cover girl. Fatima immediately looked high fashion and ready for that competitive model life. This means everything to me. This is my biggest dream. Sometimes changing your hair color can make all the difference in the world. And one girl who knows that from experience is Alexandra Agro. I mean, I'm just glad social media likes me. I don't know. Like... The model hopeful in Cycle 20 had grown up with bleach blonde hair her entire life. But Banks wanted to change things up and discover her dark side instead. So I was super excited about the brown at first. And then I sat in the chair and I was like, oh my gosh, I was born like bleach blonde hair. When Reality Wanted asked Agro if she kept her new look after the show, she said, Oh my god, yes! I told myself that I will never be the girl that cries no matter what happens. They went from bleach blonde, which I've had my whole life, to dark brown hair, but I loved it. While Alex may not have won the entire competition, her transformation on the show was a runway hit.